Well, today we're going to be cold starting the little BSA engine with the battery charger on the back. Mr. Motor Kid requested that I should start this up. Hasn't been running in a couple of months, I should think. Sort of one of those engines that you only need when you need it, so. But I've got the battery here, got a green indicator on the battery, so we should be ready to go and start her up. Alright, I've just put petrol in it, so i the car. Fuel on or off? I think that's fuel on. Let's try it out. Okay, I think she's ready to go. Let's give her a choke. Let's see if she'll start. I don't think she's going to start on the jump start. <laughs> nope. She hasn't been running in a while, and that battery hasn't done anything for quite a while. Come on, baby. Come on. Try a little bit more choke again. A little bit less. a little bit more. Come on, baby. Oh, what's wrong with her? Okay. Might have just had the fuel off. Not entirely sure. It's been a while since I started this, so I'm not exactly clued off of where all the levers should be and everything. Still running good. Wasn't too bad for a cold start after sitting for a few months. Would have helped if I had the fuel tap turned all the way on. But oh well, that's what happens when you leave site and you start to forget where certain levers should be and stuff. Oh well, we got there eventually. 
battery's showing a green indicator, but it doesn't seem to be a very strong battery. Didn't want to turn the VSA over. Um, well, that's for Mr. Motor Kid. And for anybody else who wanted to see this, start up. Okay, well, this is the other video Mr. Motor Kid requested. It's the tree lawnmower with a Mountfield RV150 engine. Easy start. And this Partner 431 deck, both of which I got for nothing. The deck came from a YouTuber and the engine came free with a Tecumseh. I've already made a few changes to it since you've last seen it. All we've really done is put this little hook on here so the pull starters all the way up here. Because when we had it down here, because originally it would have been up here, the um, spring wasn't tight enough. And that's about the only change really. Just added some petrol. It's just been absolutely pissing it down with rain. So we're now going to try to start it. in for a couple of weeks with no petrol in it. That's of course it's one of these engines so it's got a split there in the tank. A split there in the tank and eventually it piss it out. So I just put a splash in it to start it. Yeah. Not smoking anymore, but it's pretty good. So there you go Mr. Boat Kid. Both of your videos. Thanks for watching.